All right, we're working on the mirror cell here. It sells the mount, the back uh, for the mirror itself. We're going to uh, adhere the mirror down in this fashion. The mirror cell, and I've got the instructions on how to make that in another segment there. It works on a three axis set of screws. You can see the construction of it. It's just two plates. We've got springs down between inside those plates, and I've got a rubber stopper right in the center to act as a pivot for it. So as we want to adjust either one of those, it will change the focal um, alignment of the primary mirror uh, to meet with the secondary mirror. Now we're actually spraying it black at this point in time so that we can get it, so that when it's inside the telescope, it doesn't actually uh, reflect any light. That's kind of an important concept. Now when we mount that mirror inside the base of the telescope. We've got a section that's flat. On each one of them we'll put six screws into the tube itself as we uh, adhere those in there. We've also got some vents cut so that the temperature can equilibrate as the air passes up through the telescope itself. These are just simple quarter inch um, carriage bolts, springs, wing nuts to adjust with, and a single screw to hold the rubber stopper in place. Other than that, all made out of three-quarter inch plywood so that it's tough enough to handle the screws.